in what I'm saying. You are hearing. There is something God can only give, and that's Jesus. And let me start by saying this. In the bank statement of Jesus, of God himself, when you meet God next time, and you tell him, can I see your bank account? Check where it says balance. It says Jesus Christ. Jesus, listen. God cannot give you a car, a house, or any miracle you are thinking of right now. God can only give you Jesus. And the Bible says when you receive Jesus, all things are added unto you. Now, now, I have a problem because a lot of Christians are lied to. The Bible says, seek ye the kingdom of God first. And all these things shall be added unto you. So we have a problem with Christians that think prosperity should not be sought. You should not be prosperous. You should not be healed. Because all you need is to seek the kingdom. And Jesus confuses the whole statement by saying these things. He says, they shall say to you, there is the kingdom and there is the kingdom. Don't believe them. For the kingdom is already in you. Now, if the verse is saying, seek ye the kingdom first. And Jesus is saying the kingdom is in you. Only a fool begins to seek what he already has. So the only thing you need to understand now is, now that we have the kingdom inside us, we have already sought the kingdom. A believer, a Christian, is the one that has already sought the kingdom, already has Jesus inside them. So all these things are now ready to be added to me. I wish I had people. I wish I had people. Somebody here is ready to experience that scripture that says, you shall live in houses you have never built. You shall drive cars you never bought. You shall own companies you never started. In the mighty name of Jesus. Sit down.